The important training in cardiopulmonary resuscitation CPR and automated external defibrillator AED is a strategic move by TVET St. Lucia to provide educators with the skills and knowledge they require to not just provide excellent vocational training, but at the same time making sure students under their care are safe and can provide CPR AED assistance in any eventuality. The CVQ assessors and the first aid graduation ceremony conducted under the theme Celebrating Competence marked the end of the intense training for TVET instructors held at the UWI Open Campus at Montfortune. Education Minister Honorable Sean Edward says the initiative is a crucial first step towards a larger project to improve TVET quality and competency in St. Lucia. It is for this reason, the minister says, that the P.I., Auger, Grand Rivier and Stanley John Audler Memorial Secondary Schools are all currently being transformed into TVET-centered institutions. Uh, I'm extremely pleased with the work that is happening in terms of the transformation of those schools. And nothing excites me more than when, um, as a former teacher, I can see traditional classrooms being transformed into um, bubble shops and, and the other the other types of labs and amenities that we need to cause young people to venture into areas, as I said, where they can, they can become employers of themselves. The CPR AED initiative was made possible through funding from the Education Quality Improvement Project equipped and the technical expertise and instruction from the St. Lucia Red Cross. Executive Director of the St. Lucia TVET Council, Perry Thomas, says the country, through this TVET thrust, is creating the groundwork for a highly skilled workforce that can spur innovation and sustainable growth across a range of industries by investing in the professional development of TVET instructors and assessors. It must be an exercise that ensures that the list of assessors are always refreshed with new ones coming in who have acquired new competencies. The term assessor is a term used to describe a key player. Involved in the assessment and accreditation activities, they are essential to ensuring the assessments, that assessments are conducted efficiently, accurately, consistently, professionally, and ethically. Education officer for TVET, Delphia Natrum, says the CVQ assessors and first aid graduation ceremony is a monument to St. Lucia's dedication to promoting a culture of competence and equality in technical and vocational education as the country continues to prioritize improvements of its educational system. This ensures that our students being trained in CVQs and NVQs will be assessed in order to be certified themselves. Our efforts to ensure the competency of our teachers and school personnel to meet the requirements that will help us drive our TVET programs has led us to the training and certification of 29 graduates in first aid facilitated by the St. Lucia Red Cross. Special awards were also presented at the occasion to honor individuals who have contributed exceptionally to the growth of TVET in St. Lucia and shown extraordinary devotion to their work. Among the recipients of the awards were Shanez Nassis, Lester Celestin, and Dr. Marjorie Jemison Charles. From the Communications Unit of the Department of Education, Innovation and Vocational Training, I am Chris Satney, reporting.